So a quick little video. My wife's always giving me a hard time about getting my nice new shoes dirty. I'm sure a lot of you guys probably struggle the same things. Trying to work, you just forget to change out of your nice shoes into your work shoes. And they tend to get ultra dirty, right? Well, I'm gonna show you what I think is the best way to clean any pair of shoes, but especially white ones. Some big Vans fan. Matter of fact, I got several different pairs. And what I usually do is I'll kind of rotate them. So once one of my new pairs becomes old, like once I buy a new pair, then those become my work shoes and these become my church shoes. Problem is it doesn't take long and then my church shoes also become work shoes. And I got two pairs of shoes, they're both dirty. So I'm always cleaning these things. I've tried just about every concoction you can think of. And I think I've settled on a good mix. May not be that surprising to some of you guys, but I figured I'd show it anyway. All right, so I've used all kinds of stuff to try to clean these. All kinds of concoctions I read on the internet. Friends have told me um, from just household cleaner to like this goop stuff. Supposed to be able to rub this on there, it's supposed to make them clean. And never really found anything that just cleaned them the way that I wanted to clean them until this. And like I said, it's probably not gonna surprise you guys very much. But what I'll do is I'll take a little 409, just your basic 409 surface cleaner, kind of I give them a little spritz. And then what I like to do is follow up with one of these right here, the Magic Eraser. This is the trick. This works really well on Vans. It also works extremely well on like Chuck Taylors or really any white shoe. Um, but take one of these bad boys out. You can actually take like a brush like this and just give it kind of like a once over scrub. But I usually just take the magic eraser itself. A little light scrubbing. The only downfall of these is that if you scrub them too hard, they fall apart. You can kind of see what I've done to this one. And it really doesn't take that much for whatever reason. It doesn't take much and these things will come pretty dang clean. See, and these things right here have been ultra neglected too. I mean, they got southern clay mud on them and grass stains. I think I did some weed eating in these things, but a uh, little bit of work, a little bit of scrubbing before you know it, you got semi new pair of shoes. Alright guys, there you go. Hope that helps somebody get you out of get you out of the doghouse with your wife or out of trouble with your mom. I'll be I'll be over here scrubbing for the next video.